talks there are a lot of important people in here and they are making their speech and we want to share this experience with you too keep watching just like the ICRC Kizilai was born on the battlefield we walked through the terrain of Afghanistan with a guide First Thanks for acceptance. Thank you for uh, having me. I have a question for you. I think that you're on the stage with a microphone in your hand. Uh -huh. you're, and you're only allowed to say maximum three sentences to uh -huh. all groups of people, including Christians, Muslims, and all groups of religions, and all groups of uh, occupational groups. So what would you say? Wow. I should have looked at that question. Yeah, it's a, it's a good question. Uh, but um, there's so many to say, you know. Uh, I think the one thing that I would focus on, uh, I would say, is it three sentences or three uh, words? Three sentences, okay. yeah. I would even reduce it to build on commonality. Uh, uh, one of the things that we have uh, as human beings is one family of human mankind. Therefore, to build on commonality and leave the differences uh, alone. Because the difference is natural, we will all have differences within Muslims, we have differences within Christianity, we have differences, we have in Judaism and other religions as well. So we put the differences aside and build on commonality. This will bring a long lasting peace and harmony among the, uh, the you know, cross religions. Okay. Thank you so much. No problem. That's it. <laughs> yeah. What's your dream about humanity? My dream about humanity? I think my dream about uh, humanity would be that we would just care for each other a little bit. Uh, and make caring for each other easier. I think that you're on a stage with the microphone in your hand and you're only allowed to say maximum three sentences to all groups of people like Christians, Muslims and all occupational groups. What would you say? It is a challenging question. I think uh, I would say the same thing that I just said. I would say let's care for each other. I think we uh, we need to care for people we know and also care for people who don't know. We need to assume the best in people before uh, thinking the worst. Yeah, thank you so much. You said it right. Age of technology, where we can do much more to help them. First of all, thank you for accepting this. Um, I want to ask you, what are your expectations of your current generations? I hope uh, the younger generations like you will be stronger, and more courageous, more outspoken, and more willing to take risks in addressing the greatest problems that confront humanity. And I'm afraid your challenges are going to be far greater than any of the challenges that I face in my life. What's your dream about this 
Well, my dream about humanity is an optimistic one. I'm actually an optimist. You know, uh, when there is so much suffering in the world, and when you come across people who are managing their suffering and survival, I have an um, obligation to remain optimistic. So my dream is that while things look very bad at the moment, uh, as far as humanity is concerned, I think we're heading in the right direction in terms of confronting evil, in terms of uh, countering uh, injustice and disadvantage. So look forward, not look back and dream of it. Thank you so much.